please show me your basket. There are some students who are left. Please show me your basket and some objects. Or one object is quite enough. We don't need many objects. One object is quite enough. Okay, Aditya. If you don't have a ball, you can take something else, right? Take any fruit, orange, apple, or any other thing, no problem. You can take pencil box as well. It's quite fine, okay? Okay, Rian is taking notepad, all right. So who all are ready? Please show me, thumbs up sign. Naira, wrong work. Please don't do like this. You need something else. Don't hold this mouse. Take something else. Okay? Because it is connected. Right? It is connected with the computer. So use something else. Ready? Show me your basket first. Mayan, please show me your basket. Everyone, please, please focus your camera towards your thing, right? Okay, all right, okay. Listen to my instructions as this is a game, okay? All right, I need to see what are you going to do, okay? Let's see who will do first. Put your object, put your object in the basket. Put your object in the basket quickly. Now this is my basket and I've put one object inside this. So everyone please put the object, anything, whatever you have in the basket and show me. How have you put, show me, show me your basket. Okay, in the basket. Divija, time over. Naira, please show me. Put the object in your basket. Garvit, please show me. Where have you put? Please show me. You need to show me, Vita. You need to show me. Divija, put, put the fruit in your basket. Put the fruit in your basket. Okay, yes, very good. Now this is my phone and I'm putting it in my basket. Has everyone put? Now, Take out, take out your object and put it on the table. Put it on the table. Take out your object and put it on the table. I want to see that. Take out the object and put it on the table. On, 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 on the table. And show me that. How have you put? I want to see the position of your object on the table. Very good. Very good. Next. Next. Uh, put your object. Put your object on the top of the basket. Put your object on the top. On the top of your basket. On the top of your basket. Aditya, listen. Put the object on the top of your basket. Very good, Naira. Very good, Devansh. Very good, Savi. Very good, Pura. Very good, Sanchita. On the top of your basket. On the top. Very good, Rui. Very good. This is on the top. What is this? On the top. Okay. Now, now put your object in front of your basket. Put the object in front of the basket. In front of. In front of. Put the object in front of your basket. In front of. And show me how have you put in front of very good Divija, very good Naira, uh, very good Garvit, Rudru. I cannot see the object in front of your basket. Rian, I cannot see the object in front of your basket. Akshat, I cannot see. Very good Dushan. Very good Mayan. Okay, very good. So this is in front of you are putting the object in front of the basket. This is the position of your object okay now put your object listen very carefully put your object behind put your object behind the basket put your object behind the basket and show me 
behind the basket behind the basket very good very good 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 behind put the object behind the basket very good savi is showing me and uh, she is demonstrating very well uh devansh also very good devansh okay sanchita behind sanchita behind behind yes behind okay very good now put the object beside put the object beside the basket beside the basket put the object beside the basket put the object beside put the object beside the basket okay now put your object now see the difference see the difference right now the object is beside now you have to put the object near near put the object near to the basket not beside near to the basket near to the basket not beside the vision near this is beside and this is near near means it is closer but not exactly and beside it is quite near right so this is the difference so everyone please put the object near to the basket okay now those who have two objects those who have two objects what they are going to do they have to put they have to put the uh, uh, they have to put the basket between two objects put the basket between two objects listen again put the basket between between two objects let's see who is going to do the basket between two objects very good sanchita has done savi has done and i'm waiting okay devansh has done divija has done naira has done garvit has done very good kaira good mayan very good akshat very good riyan okay prinjal i cannot see you so this is between right now your basket is between right between the two objects okay put your object under put your object under the basket put your object under the basket not in the basket no sanchita this is in under the basket put your object under the basket under the basket very good we correct what is my question what, what, what is my question very good garvit correct you are not so very good devansh you are not supposed to put the object in the basket you have to put the object under under the basket no kaira it is wrong under under the basket okay divija please do please put your things put please put your objects under under the basket very good very good okay very good 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 so we have used in we have used on and give me a minute please we have used in under beside behind near in front of right these are the words we have used right these are the words we have used now can anybody tell me what are they known as what are they known as okay we have used between as well no between let's write down between what are they called as these words come on tell me who is going to tell me what do we call these words yes ruhi tell me ma'am prab prab 
Very good prepositions. These are prepositions, right? These are prepositions. Can anybody tell me the meaning of preposition? Who is going to tell me the meaning of preposition? Do you know the meaning of preposition? What does this word tell you? What is the meaning of preposition? Who is going to tell me? Please raise hand. Yes, Rudra, tell me, what is the meaning of preposition? Very good, Aditya, correct answer. Preposition tell us where are thin, thin person and animal. Okay, very good. Correct answer, anybody else? Anybody else who would like to tell me? Let me ask Aditya, as Aditya told me the answer. Yes, Aditya. What do you mean by preposition? What is the meaning of preposition? What does it tell you? Yes, Aditya? The position. Yes, the answer. The answer of this question is already in this word. Pre Position, preposition. That means, that means it tells you, this word tells you where the noun is, right? Where the noun is. Noun may be uh, anything, any object, animal, right? Human beings, anything, okay? All right? Preposition tells us the position of the noun. Right? Just like in, on, under, beside, behind, near, in front of, between, and many more. Right? These are only some of the examples. Okay? Understood, everyone? Understood? Okay. Where is the cat? Okay, now we uh, need to find out where is the cat. Cat moves here and there now, right? Cat moves here and there. Now you will find cat sometimes in front of the box, sometimes between, sometimes behind, sometimes over. Okay. After watching this video, you'll be able to answer it. This is part in the either side of an object or a person we are talking about. We use the word between or we can say something is in the center of two things or person. Let's see some examples. The dog is... So where is the dog right now? Dog is sitting between the two boxes, right? And the position where the dog is sitting is between, right? The preposition which we have used to define the position of a dog is between, right? So between is the preposition used for the dog. Where Where is he sitting, right? Where is he sitting? He's sitting between the two boxes. So between word is telling the position of the dog, right? Understood? Between two boxes. Two boxes are there and in between the dog is sitting. 
the house is between the two trees so can you see the given picture the house is between the two trees right so this word between is telling the position of the house that it is between two trees all right and between is the preposition used for the position of the house next one behind everybody knows the meaning of behind right everybody knows the meaning of behind behind means peach you know when an object or a person we are talking about is at the back of something else we use the word behind example okay can you see this clown the clown is hiding behind the country uh, curtain <laughs> the clown is hiding behind the curtain so behind is telling you the position of the clown right it is hi he is hiding okay all right the clown is hiding behind the curtain here behind is the preposition the dog is behind the box the dog is hiding the dog is behind the box next is in front of when someone or something is ahead of another thing we use a word in front. so which word to be used which preposition to be used if some someone or any noun is a hat of something we use in front of in front of okay front of example he is sitting in front of his computer so where is the boy sitting the boy is sitting in front of the computer right okay the dog is sitting in front of the car so where is the dog sitting the dog is sitting in front of the car and this in front of is telling the position of the dog right next is over we use this preposition when we are talking about above or higher than something else let's see the example the horse is jumping over the fence the birds are flying over the house now let me test your knowledge okay who is going to tell me the answer the cat is dash the box who will tell me the position of the cat sanshita tell me the position of the cat is it between behind or over yes sanshita please on mute repeat again mam cat behind the box very good the cat is behind the box where is the cat in the beginning i asked you this question now i believe you all are able to answer it the cat is dash the box between behind or over the cat is behind the box very good next one where is the cat where is the cat who is going to tell me where is the cat come on raise up and tell me where is the cat tell me the position of the cat ma'am the cat is between the box very good not box but a boxes because there are two boxes okay very good athar the cat is sitting between the two boxes right the cat is in the center 
the cat is dash the box options are in front of over or between the correct answer is the cat is between the box tell me the first position that is a who is going to tell me the position of the bag a a position position a who is going to tell me sabhi tell me position a ma'am under very good it is under this bag is under let me just write down under good sabhi who is going to tell me next yes akshat tell me the uh, tell me position b of the bag position b where is the bag yes akshat please unmute tell me position b beta ma'am in very good in the bag is in the car very good who is going to tell me position c yes myra tell me position c yes ma'am tell me position c of the bag on the table very good on the table absolutely correct very good who is going to tell me position d who is going to tell me position d sabia tell me position d yes position yes but then Sorry. The bag is the car. Bitta, tell me position D. This position D. Where is the bag? Ma'am, bag is sit. The bag. The bag is. So, my dear, repeat with me. A bag is. Speak up. A bag is. On the chair. On, on the chair. Again, because it is touching the surface, it is on the top of the uh, chair, right? It is, it is on the surface of the chair. So that is why which preposition on? Which preposition will be used? On. Okay, Kavya. Yes. Please learn all the prepositions. Okay. Clear, everyone.